Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. D.A. will join us tonight on the sideline. Look at the opening lineup for the Memphis Grizzlies. They've got Marcus Smart. Desmond Bain out there with Jaron Jackson. And there's Bismack Biambo. And it's Morant in at the one spot. And for Dallas, we've got Doncic. Powell is out there with Derek Jones. Then it's Green. And it's Irving at the two spot. And so off the tip, it's Memphis. Outside, smart. Some nice passing there by Memphis. Morant dishes to Biombo. Lock at six. And they double up Jackson. And they turn over the 24-second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. Irving and here's Jones pass to Powell outside Irving the three craps in the tray you know that goes back I think to playing with LeBron in their Cleveland days Kyrie learned how to operate without the ball some and Clark, don't you have to admire the way the Mavericks are always looking to compete? Yeah, I like that, Kevin. It's a good point by you. It starts at the top of the organization. I mean, the team has really avoided any kind of lengthy rebuild to their credit. They want to win, and this team uh, is definitely capable of doing that. Pass to Irving. Doncic looking it over. Pass to Green. Just five on the clock. That shot, no good. Some solid defense there from Jackson. And here's Moran. He'll bring it up for the Grizzlies. And the best is smart. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. A little over a minute 30 into this first quarter. Irving passes to Jones. Green against Morant. And it's Green missing. And the Grizzlies with possession. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Well, Kevin, Coach Taylor Jenkins gave me a few minutes to catch up. He told me they have to lean on their post game tonight. He wants them to get the ball into the block each time down the floor and pound those guys inside. Sounds like this could be a real physical battle, Kevin. Back to you. Thank you, David. Here's Paul. Following the basket by John Morant. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Dwight Powell's combination of athleticism and focus allow him to score despite getting bumped around. The Mavericks shooting their first free throw this game. At the line for Dallas. Dwight Powell. One shot. The free throw drops for Powell. Well, one of the things I really like about Dwight Powell is that he doesn't play outside of himself. He plays to his strengths. Morant kicks to Smart. Back to Morant. Now, here's Biombo. Not a lot of room. Shoots over Powell. Biombo, no luck. The Mavericks leading. Jones, the pass to Irving. And the rejection by Jackson. Outside, smart. Pass to Jackson. Jackson is doubled. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And right out of the gate, trying to set the tone defensively, you got to love that energy. And 
here are the Grizzlies now. Morant passes to Bain. And the shot goes in. Desmond Bain. A point who knows his role. Ja loves setting guys up, always looking to pass it. Smart against Irving. Back to Green. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That one's on Morant. And, and I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. Definitely saved the layup with that foul, and he'll make him earn them from the line, and that's what you want to see. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he makes the first. Both free throws good from Green. Here's Morant. And here in the first quarter with a little over three and a half minutes played. Here's Jackson. Second shot opportunity. And the layup is up and in. And I like seeing Jackson use that length on the offensive glass. You don't have to be the most physical guy when you have a wingspan like that. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like it. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. Let your hands together for your detailed crew. On defense, Memphis. It's Irving, top of the key. Conjures outside. Six on the shot clock. And Jaron Jackson picks up the foul. Jaren that is his first foul of the game. First personal foul. Third team foul. Outside Irving. The three. Here's Powell. Boy, Biombo provides great energy and is a dogged defender who doesn't make anything easy. Jones, the best to pop. On the wing, Irving. Over Smart, and Irving with the basket on the assist by Powell. Irving's got five men. One of the things you've got to admire and respect about him is his aggressiveness at the offensive end, always in attack mode. Payne for three. Sinks the three-pointer. And that's exactly what he's looking for, draining the triple. Doncic kicks to Green. Pass to Irving from downtown. Drains it from beyond the arc. Eight points for him. The fire that Irving plays with, Admiral. I mean, you can feel it. When you make a three on him, it's payback time. He's coming at you. Now here's Smart. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Gets, Gets it to Bain. fall. The bucket from Bain. And we've seen several lead changes tonight. Neither team giving an inch. Yeah, and the lead has changed hands, and it just hasn't stayed in those hands very long when it's changed. Back and forth we go. Jackson against Jones. Back to Doncic. Shot clock at six. Trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Boy, what balance from Doncic. I mean, he never seems to get rattled, even when he attracts contact on the way to score. Maintains his poise in those situations extremely well for a young player. First personal foul. First team foul. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. At the line for the Grizzlies, John Moran taking two shots. good from Morant already embracing his role as a leader on this team Morant brings a strong work ethic and winning mentality to this team
No good on the second free throw. You can tell that miss at the line might stick with him for a while. Always hurts to miss a chance to take the lead. Back to Doncic. Score the basket, his second of two attempts. You know, as I watch Doncic, I think it's futile to try to distract this guy. His focus and concentration and control of himself is uh, excellent. Here's Jackson. Combo trying to break free. Jackson, Jackson gets the bucket. And the defense no factor, which is why he simply laid it in. Dallas calls timeout. Uh-oh. The last second gets a free t-shirt. All right. Let's hear it one more time for your favorite game. Dallas has gone two or three from deep so far in this game. Outside green. Back to Doncic. Irving for three. Another three for Dallas. When you play with Luka now, Doncic, he's ready to find you if you're open, so you've got to be ready to receive. Back to Morant. Here's Biombo. Good. And the nice assist from Morant. Wow, fired that bounce pass in there. Beautiful. Here's Doncic. Powell oh, trying to free himself up. And the layup's good off the glass. Doncic has got six. Doncic, such a difficult matchup. Too big for a guard, too skilled for most wings. Luka is simply a problem in capital letters, exclamation point. So timeout called here. The first for Memphis. Williams is checked in for the Mavericks. Tim Hardaway Jr. comes in for Green. Memphis also making some changes. Tillman, he's checked in for Biombo, and it's Williams in for Smart. Jackson kicks to Bain. Passes it to Morant. It's Jackson atop the key. Outside, Bain. From deep, lock it four, and the three ball is good. Three. Baines got it all tied up now for Memphis. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. High octane action for sure. Crowd pleasing already. Now here is Hardaway. Now here's Irving. And Dallas again with the bucket. Well, you know, on some nights, Irving's just unguardable, and that's when you just keep letting him do his thing. Outside, Bain. Back to Morant. Some nice passing there by Memphis. Williams passes to Tillman. And stolen by Kyrie Irving. And here we go. The Mavericks in a fast break. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. Tell you what, this is what Irving can do now. He'll leak out and then make the right read in transition. away against Morant. The dish to Jackson. That one drops Jared for him. Jackson Jr. Jackson's got six. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Irving looking for an opening. On the wing, Doncic. Guarded by Bain. And Doncic gets it to go. <laughs> The Grizzlies trailed by four. Outside, Bain. Back to Morant. To the middle. That's good from Williams. The assist by Morant. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. Powell kicks to Hardaway. Doncic trying to get open and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Second personal foul. When Hardaway Jr. is forcing the issue like that, it draws the defense's attention, and I like his aggressiveness as a student. The Mavericks shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight.
and the first one drops. You know, you look at Hardaway Jr. right now. I think efficiency is everything. Should be the priority for him. I think he has the talent, no doubt, but just needs to play to his strengths a little bit more. Hardaway hits them both. The Grizzlies trail by four. Now a timeout, timeout called by timeout Memphis. Called for Memphis. Here they come. Your Bain passes to Jackson. Score the basket. Jerry His fourth. He's only missed one of his five shots tonight. And don't forget, his dad played in the NBA as well. So Jackson probably grew up getting bumped all the time trying to score in the backyard. Two minutes remaining in the now here's Dutchich. He's got eight. Here's Hardaway. And it goes down two points. And the Mavericks lead by four. But Hardaway Jr. is a competitor now, showing you some real toughness. He's not going to give you an inch. He's going to fight you to the finish. Here's Williams. Outside, Bain. Five on the clock. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. First personal foul. And going up strong inside demonstrates confidence. That's a lot for the Grizzlies. Moran, not afraid to get physical. Two shots. And let's take a moment, guys, to get your take on the scoring so far for the Mavericks. Oh, man. How about the mid-range jumper from these guys? It's on tonight. A huge part of their offense so far. You know, something else is working for them is the three-point shooting. I mean, they've done some damage early on from behind the arc. A different look for Dallas. Morris is checked in for Powell. And Curry subbed in for Irving. Both free throws good from Morant. We've got 128 left in the first quarter. Doncic passes to Hardaway. Back to Doncic. Inside, here's Williams. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Doncic, so multifaceted. A stat sheet stuffer supreme. He does everything, including dropping down. Fabric style. Grant Williams. Second personal foul. For Memphis, they have gone 13. three and four at the free throw line tonight. Shooting for Memphis. Ja Morant. At the line for two. Free throw, no good. Wow, well, what did he have something in his eye on that shot? <laughs> Maybe. And the second free throw, good. And uh, 101 left the play here in the first. Doncic kicks to Kurt. Now the pass to Hardaway. And they call an illegal screen. Here. Illegal screen. And guys, point of emphasis ball. for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows, or they'll call it. Now here's Bain. 11 points in the game. It's good. Desmond Baines got 13 points. And you know, coaches will take possessions like that all day long. Phenomenal use of the screen there. Right side, Williams. Chalk up two there. Great win. And the Mavericks lead by three. A precision passer, Curry, also excellent at seeing his guys when they're open. A floater. And Morant will lay it in. Ten points for him. 
He knew what he wanted to do all along. The teardrop. Up top, Doncic. Guarded by Bain. And misses it off the right side of the rim. What a performance for Kyrie Irving. He has been the story for Dallas. He witnessed him delivering a series of three-pointers as he knocks three total in the quarter. Back to the action in just a minute. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far on the scoreboard. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen here, guys, from the Mavericks. I mean, offensively, I thought they did a good job of protecting the ball. And defensively, boy, were they disruptive. Yeah, I like the way they forced a ton of turnovers and then took advantage of those turnovers with opportunistic baskets. Greg, you look at a player putting up big numbers on a losing team. How do you determine if those are quality numbers, so to speak? You know, Kevin, it's a, a great question because somebody's going to put up points or, or collect rebounds or get assists. So, you know, you look at efficiency, you, you look at effort, and there's no doubt that you can have winning players on losing teams. So on the floor to begin things for Memphis here in the second quarter. Jackson is out there with Bismack Biombo. Then there's Smart. Then it's Williams. Six to shoot. Here's Smart. And a kind first roll that time off the rim as it unfolds. First personal foul. And so it's Williams who brings it up for the Mavericks. Smart again, Irving with the shot. And another basket for Dallas. You know, when Irving rises up to take these shots, so smooth in how he gets it done. He always seems to be in control. Back to Smart. Jackson against Jones. And they double up Jackson. Smart wide open. He fires. That one's no good. That makes him one for two. Here's Jones. The basket is good off the assist from Williams. Jones has got the lead up to five now for the man. Smart kicks to Williams. Now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. And then Biombo with the dunk. Yeah, he's a threat to throw it down every time he's near the rim. At six foot nine, Biombo has not only the height, but the strength and bounce to jam it down. Now Irving. He's got 17. Down low. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. Great assist that time by Kyrie Irving. The Grizzlies trail by five. Outside Williams. Jackson looking it over. Memphis moving that ball around. Yambo doesn't go for him. Now the Mavericks take it the other way. Hardaway kicks to Irving. Unloads. The Grizzlies pull it in. And that one is hammered home. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. This is to Williams. Here's Biombo. Williams with the defensive effort. Dallas leading by three. Let's a floater go. And Green with the lay-in. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Guarded by Green. Outside, Smart. It's up a three. Kyrie Irving with the rebound. Dallas has gone three of five from beyond the arc so far tonight. Outside, Green. Back to Irving.
outside Williams. This one for three. Rebound by Williams. The Grizzlies trail by five. There's the three. Up and in. Off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Boy, from the looks of it, it appears the defense is fine with him taking that shot, but he makes them pay when they do. Irving dishes to Hardaway. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Second personal foul. You got to give Hardaway Jr. credit, guys. I mean, he's excellent at finding ways to get to a spot and then make the defense compromise. The Mavericks have been on target from the free throw line. They're 5 of 5 in that department. And their numbers from the line last season, they're good, just not great. About 77% as a team. Shoot two. First free throw is good. Hardaway hits them both. And it's smart with the ball for the Memphis Grizzlies. Four-point game. Left side, Jackson. Outside, smart. Shot clock at five. No good from outside. You can't miss those, but even the best do on occasion. Irving passes to Green. Hardaway from outside. That one doesn't drop. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Offensive rebound. Mavericks leading by four. Back to Green. To the inside. On the basket by Jones. Jones has got six. Now a timeout called by Memphis. Timeout called for Memphis. The Grizzlies trail by six. Morant kicks to Williams. Back to Morant. Outside, Bain. That three off the mark. Dallas has gone 0-3 from beyond the arc to start the second quarter. Taken away by Williams. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. First personal foul. First team foul. The Grizzlies have made four That's free throws the from the line and missed two. Definitely an area where they can improve. Only 73% as a team from the line last year. And I know the free throw shooting is an area they focused on improving coming into this season. The first one falls. And good on the second, so he makes them both. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Outside, green. Trying to find Jones. He gets it to him. And he gets the whistle for the three-second call. Memphis ball. The Grizzlies trail by four. Morant looking around. Jones against Spain. Five to shoot. 
It falls for the sixth Get time in bang. seven tries this contest. That's 86%. For Dallas, they've gone 6 of 10 from the floor here in the second quarter. Irving finds Hardaway. Dallas moving the ball around. Green bounce pass. Williams passes to Irving. Six on the shot clock. Fires the three. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. Memphis has gotten a success rate of just over 50% from three-point tonight. Four of seven shooting. Pass to Bain. Over Irving. Bain, no good. The Mavericks leading. Outside Irving. They kick it out to Green. Shoots. Irving's shot is good. Irving's got four this quarter. Memphis has gone one of four from three-point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. Outside Williams. Pass to Biombo. Down to five on the shot clock. Pulls it up. Williams can't get it to go. Mavericks leading by four. Here's Irving. Good again. He's on tonight. Nine for 13 shooting. Irving, excellent at converting with either hand. He's got a special talent for finishing in the lane. Williams finds Jackson. Back to Williams. Outside, Payne. And good as it just snugs right down through the net. And he can take over in a nanosecond. I mean, once he catches fire, it's difficult to squelch it. Back to Irving. Here's Jones. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. For Dallas, they have made the most out of their opportunities at the line. They have yet to miss in seven attempts. And that one falls for Jones. And some changes here for the Mavericks. Dwight Powell's checked in for Grant Williams. Morris comes in for Green. And Doncic is subbed in for Hardaway. And so Jones nails both of them. Here's Morant. He's got 10. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Eleven feet away, and the jumper is good. Oh, Moran. Moran's got 12. And it just seems like Moran is always ready to outwork the defense. A big effort pays off for him there inside. Anjic passes to Morris. Irving with it from deep three-point range. The shot's good on the assist by Morris. Irving's got the lead up to seven out for Dallas. Not just range, but confidence, too. Irving can capitalize from way downtown. Morant passes to Bain. It doesn't go for him. And it's Dallas the other way. Here's Doncic. Good on the shot. And now it's a nine-point Maverick lead. And they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys. And, and it's paid off. Outside, Williams. Passes it to Bain. Shoots the three. Mavericks with the rebound. Jones looking for an opening. Out to Doncic. The pass to Jones. Makes it off the glass. Jones has got 10 points in the quarter. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Boy, the defense looks shell-shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels. 
and the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Doncic finds Powell. Back to Doncic. Three-pointer. John ja Morant grabs the rebound. And so Morant will bring it up for the Grizzlies. They trail by 11. And they've won the rebound battle so far, and it's translated to the scoreboard. Well, the effort level they've had has been outstanding. Hard to keep a team down when they play with that much energy. Yeah, but I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Hey, they've got a nice, comfortable lead here, fellas. Might as well keep it simple. Do it a plain simple one-hander, just like pound cake. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. So Morant, he'll go to the free throw line. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. The Grizzlies have gone six of eight from the free throw line tonight. Seth Curry, he's checked in for Irving. Morant, no good on the free throw. Here's Dallas. They're on a 15-6 run. Offensive rebound. Curry, good! Hey, I like and respect the hustle of Curry that time. Doing some work on the offensive glass. Here's Morant. And the shot is good. Morant. Morant's got six in the quarter. I love the spirit he's shown tonight, particularly on the offensive end. Oh, I tell you what, the hole would be a lot deeper if he wasn't being as efficient as he's been so far. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on it. And so it's Dallas. 13 points up at the end of the period. They've been putting on a clinic in the paint. Shots are falling with regularity, and they are pounding it down low. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Taylor Jenkins is here with us in the second quarter. Coach, tough sledding at both ends of the floor. How do you fix it? You know, it hurts our offense when we're not able to get stops and get out and run in, so not a good quarter for us. You know, we just got to keep being aggressive defensively and be a little bit more disciplined. And we'll see if that can pick up as the game continues. Thanks, Coach. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. And now the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. Let's talk about that first half. Kyrie Irving was red hot to start the first. He ended up with 24 points, two rebounds, and three assists. Shaq, what's your take on that? They were getting after it on the glass. Like, wow, they're they got a nice edge in that department, which has led to this lead. They won the heart and hustle battle in that first half. Now we'll see if they can keep that going. And now, Kenny, let's get your opinion on Memphis. Well, it's never fun. When you're playing against the team that's on fire. This team was on fire. They showed effort on defense, but it didn't matter. They couldn't get the stops. I don't think the opponent could sustain this kind of shooting. And that should do it. With the second half about to begin, let's send you back to Kevin Harlan. Go back to Kevin Harlan. Go. Go over there. Get out of your seat. Get on your feet. And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. You look at Kyrie Irving in this game, he has been everywhere. Man, he's been running wild on him through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. And you know what? I'll be interested to see just how much he's got left in the tank. That first half had to take a lot out of him. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Green is up there with Derek Jones. And it's Kyrie Irving. Then there's Luka Doncic. And it's Powell in at the center. That's the five to begin the second half for Jason Kidd. Got a piece of it. Morant with the steal. Goes up. And Morant throws it down. 
Uh, the level of engagement Morant provides uh, really on both ends. That play demonstrates how special this kid can be. Anjic passes to Jones. Back to Doncic. Lock at six. Fires for three. Here's Powell. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Powell's got the lead up to 13 now for Dallas. Boy, Powell showing you great aggressiveness that time. Fighting hard to come up with that offensive rebound. Smart kicks to Morant. Pass to Bain. Some nice passing there by Memphis. Here's Biombo. That one good for two. Biombo's got six points. And Biombo is used to taking a pounding now. I mean, he's a physical guy, so he expects physicality in return, especially when he's going up with a shot. Pass to Irving. The three for Dungeon. Rebounded by Smart. The Grizzlies trailed by 11. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single-digit lead. For a guy who's still working on his range, love to see Smart attacking on the interior. Morant against Green. On the wing, Doncic. Powell trying to free himself up. And Doncic gets it to go. He's got 16. So good at getting to his spots and then cashing in, making the game look easy. Morant passes to Bain. Smart again, Irving. Back to Bain. And the Grizzlies tack on two more. Got himself into really good position there. Can't pass that shot up, guys. Dallas calls timeout. And team strategies closely guarded one aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. Typically there's some type of adjustment made out of a timeout. It might be major or it could be just a slight tweak. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Doncic kicks to green. Back to Doncic. Passes to Powell. Just five to shoot. And block. That one goes Green careening Green off the glass. Violation. Excellent timing by Biombo and an impressive vertical, too. He's a good shot blocker because of that. And that rejection had some mustard on it. Huge, huge play. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for the Memphis Grizzlies. Just four points. That's all they've given up here in the second half. And a wide open look for Bain. And Jones pulls it down. Jones has got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Powell. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Jones has got three assists in the game. Morant kicks to Smart. Second half here. We're just over three and a half minutes into it. Payton for three. On his 15th shot made. attempt, he makes his ninth basket. Shooting a healthy 60% tonight. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Here's Doncic. The Grizzlies pull it in. Jackson's got his sixth rebound on the night. Morant outside. He kicks it to Jackson. Launches a three. Smart misses. Mavericks leading by eight. Here's Green. The rejection by Jackson. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. That's going to be on Kyrie Irving. 
high effort play by Moran. He refuses to let the foul stop him Shooting from, from getting the shot up. In a moment to look at the scoring Taking approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Mavericks. You know, all game long, they've imposed their will on the interior, scoring a lot of points in the painted area. And the other thing that stands out is just how well they have moved the ball. Everyone's touching it and having a chance to create. And, you know, he may finally be rounding into form after what's been a tough game for him at the line prior to this trip. Both free throws good from Morant. The Mavericks have gone a lackluster three of nine from the field since halftime. The pass to Green. On the wing, Jones. It's Biombo with the rebound. Biombo's got four rebounds now tonight. Smart. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. Yeah, he earned that one. I mean, taking the hit and still able to get that one to go down. And incredible, incredible body control right there. Don't know how he was able to get that one to go, but it sure was a thing of beauty to watch. And that one falls for Smart. And some of what Smart gives this team doesn't always show up in the stat sheet, but, but he makes plays that help you win. And the Mavericks call time here. They're trying to stem the tide here. Yeah, you know, they had to do something, anything to stop this run. You can't just let it go on any longer. Mavericks leading by three. Outside Irving. Now, here's Green, guarded closer. Count it, good. Green's got six points. That's the kind of aggressive and assertive play they need as we get closer and closer to crunch time. Okay, time now for an injury report. Let's get an update on Desmond Bain. What's the status, David? Thanks, Kevin. Well, I got some news from Memphis's head athletic trainer. He's got a pinched nerve in his shoulder, basically a stinger, and he's lost all sense of motion in his arm. Thanks for the status report there, David. At least we now know, uh, Greg, how he's doing. Yeah, when, when you talk injury, the unknown factor is always a difficult thing to deal with. And, you know, for him, just watching his teammates unable to contribute, that's really a helpless feeling. Three. And that's just a great job of staying ready by Moran. He didn't need to dominate the ball to score there. On your job side. Kicks to Irving. Pass to Jones. Stolen by Jackson. Bonjic with the steal. To the paint. Here's Powell. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Doncic has got his fifth assist in this one. Green against Morant. Memphis moving that ball around. To smart. Shot clock at six. Memphis needs to get off a shot here. And it's Morant missing. Mavericks leading by six. Doncic outside. Here's Powell. It's rebounded by Memphis. Biombo's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Nice D from Doncic. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Mavericks. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Here's Smart. Seven points in the game. Passes it to Biombo. To the wing right side. Corner shot. And it's Morant missing. Dallas has gone 0-2 from deep to start things here in the second half. And it's good off the back rim and in. And that's now 18 points for Luka Doncic. Timeout called the Grizzlies. 
and the lack of rim protection top of the list. Yeah, you know, just look at the numbers, guys. I mean, they are being taken to the woodshed in the paint. On the Mavericks with some changes, Rashawn Holmes comes in for Dwight Powell, and Tim Hardaway Jr. subbed in for Green. Substitution on the court. Outside, Bain. Jackson against Jones. Down low. Shot is good, and the John Mavericks lead is cut down to just six points and the bucket from Morant. Well, Morant is certainly making his presence felt on offense. He's in total attack mode. Back to Doncic. The pass to Holmes. Now, here is Irving. Here's Doncic. They get it back. And another shot. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. First personal foul. Look at First Luka playing foul. hard, which is always the way he goes. Hits a foul, but keeps pushing and takes his shot. Playing through contact. And the Mavericks have an exceptional Luka. shooting free throws tonight. Going nine for nine. Two shots. First one falls for him. Now an MVP caliber player, Doncic's drive is evident. I mean, he's somebody that wants to be a Hall of Famer when it's all said and done. And he's well on his way based on what he's done thus far. All three throws good from Doncic. The Grizzlies trail by eight. Outside Williams. Back to Morant. With the teardrop, that drops, John and it comes Morant. off an assist from Williams. Morant's got 27. Yeah, and the delicate touch on display there. Gotta love when Morant lets that floater fly off his fingertips. Beautiful. And here's Doncic from the arc. That doesn't go either for Doncic. Oh, it's been a turbulent quarter, really rough for him. Nothing going his way, but he seems determined to shoot his way out of it. Morant passes to Tillman, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. And he might be small for a center, but boy, can he jump out of the building. Back to Doncic. Foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Second personal foul. That's on Jaron Jackson. Doncic, because he's so skilled and so savvy, he does a nice job forcing the defense into tough spots when they're guarding him. Taking two shots. First free throw is good. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And so here's Memphis. Six-point game. Morant kicks to Williams. Pass to Bain. The three from Morant. He can't get that one to fall. And it's Dallas the other way. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. And that one's good, Irving. If you allow him to get that close, you deserve to get scored on. Outside, Bain. Back to Morant. Inside, Tillman, no good on that one. Good work defensively by Holmes. Here's Irving. Doncic dishes to Hardaway. Back to Doncic. 
good, and the assist goes to Hardaway. And it's a 10-point Dallas lead. Boy, once Doncic gets on the roll, there aren't many ways to slow him down. Huge night so far. Williams passes to Jackson. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. I tell you what, what a good thing that he showed up today because without him, this thing would already be over. Shooting the night has gone two for two at the strike. Grant Williams is checked in for Dallas. Curry comes in for Irving. And the Grizzlies also with the sub. Aldama's checked in. Throw good, Bain. Dallas leading by seven. Doncic kicks to Hardaway. Pass to Curry from outside the arc. The Grizzlies pull it in. Williams, that's a two-pointer. The Grizzlies with another miss. The Maverick shooting has been just great so far, up at 56%. Doncic outside. They get it back. Williams can't get it to go. The Grizzlies trail by seven. Here's the teardrop. And Williams with the nice bucket inside. Williams has got his second basket of the game. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. on the shot clock. Holmes trying to free himself up. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. First personal foul. And this is his third trip to the line tonight. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Luka Doncic. At the line for two. And he knocks down the first one. And he makes both free throws. One second left. Can't hit that one. And so it's the Dallas Mavericks headed to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. They're feeling very confident, shooting the ball with great efficiency and dictating the pace. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And now we have a moment to uh, reveal our state farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. Served him up a tasty room service dime right there, boy. And with three quarters behind us, let's see what this fourth period holds in store for us. On the court for Memphis to start the fourth. Bismack Biambo is out there with Jaron Jackson. Then there's Desmond Bain. Then it's Williams. And Green with the basket on the assist by Williams. Williams has got three assists in the game. The Grizzlies trail by nine. Back to Williams. Passes to Bain. Six to shoot. No good on the triple. Mavericks leading by nine. Doncic with it. And he lays it straight in. And that's now 28 points for Luka Doncic. We play just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. And there's the pass to Bain. A three ball. 
and Curry pulls it down. Dallas shooting has been just great so far, up at 56%. And that one drops. Green's got the lead up to 13 now for the man. They're taking it right into the teeth of the defense, and, and it's a defense that's starting to look frustrated. Well, they should be. I mean, it has not been a good performance for them at that end of the floor. Bain with it, and Curry picks him up defensively. He gets that one. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the deep. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Bounce pass from Williams. Pass to Doncic. Here's the floater. Good. Great play by Green to set it up. Green's got three assists now in this one. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Yep, it goes. And the Dallas lead is cut back down to 11. Big bucket there from Biombo. And Biombo is highly effective down low. Knows where to post up in the paint. And here is Curry. And stolen by Biombo. Fast break Memphis. Williams leading the charge. Good work there as it goes. Williams has got it back down to a single digit deficit for the Grizzlies. Doncic passes to Holmes. Curry kicks to Doncic. Pass to Holmes. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting shot. Jackson Jr. Yeah, the defender all over. He got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. At the line for Dallas, Rashawn Holmes. Taking two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And some changes here for the Mavericks. Powell, he's checked in for Williams. And it's Kyrie Irving in for Seth Curry. Smart's checked in for the Grizzlies. Both free throws, good from home. Third minute of action now gone here in the fourth. Outside, smart. He dishes it to Biombo. Bain looking around. Rocket six, outside Jackson. Trains the three-pointer. Jackson and for perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. Doncic finds Irving. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got six assists in the game. Well, he's been doing it all night. Why not go back to it? And no let up in him either, guys. I mean, he wants to continue to expand that lead. And as long as he's the one taking the shots, that lead's going to expand. They get the rebound. Bain trying to free himself up. Shot is good, and the Mavericks lead is cut down now to just eight on the basket from Jackson. Donjic passes to Irving. And here is Green. Donjic outside. Bain with it. He's picked up by Donjic. Bain, no good. Mavericks leading by eight. Now here's Green. Outside Irving. Pass to Holmes. Rebound by Williams. Memphis has gotten just one of four three-pointers to go down for them here in the fourth. He kicks to Smart. Shoots over Powell. Smart misses. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Takes it inside. And Doncic throws it down. Big talent flush by Doncic. Man, this young fella really has a lot of game. Outside, smart. There's the pass to Biombo. Powell with the steal. Green with the ball. Williams picks him up. The drive by Green. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. 
That Second one on smart. All oh, the officials are all over that one. Line, Clearly a foul. I mean, didn't give him any choice three. but to blow the Two whistle. Shots. I mean, you got to play without fouling. That one is off. Garrett Jones, he's checked in for Rashawn Holmes. Good on the second free throw. And so here's Memphis. They trail by 11. Outside, Smart. Back to Williams. Now, here's Biombo. Guarded by Powell. Smart kicks to Bain. Five on the clock. Pass to Williams. Back to Bain. For the three. And the foul called on Bismack Biombo. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. A different look for Dallas. Williams comes in for Dwight Powell. Hardaway is subbed in for Green. Memphis also making some changes. Tillman comes in for Biombo. And it's John Morant in for Williams. Mavericks leading by 11. Right side, Irving. Takes it from 10. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. Irving's got four points in the quarter. How about Irving showing you great energy there, just refusing to be boxed out? Bain passes to Smart. To the middle. Here's Tillman. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got six rebounds now in the game. Irving from long range. The offensive rebound. The Grizzlies trail by 13. And there's the call on Jones. Jones That's foul number two for him. First I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. Yeah, it looked like it. I mean, he kind of slid underneath as he got to the spot, too. Dallas making a switch here. Powell's checked in. Outside, smart. Back to Morant. And Morant throws it down. Assist from. And how about that Martin display smart. of athleticism by Morant flying up in the air for the jam? Pass to Hardaway. Kicks to Jones, lets the three fly, and the rejection by Jackson. And they'll turn it over. Could not get off a shot. 24 second violation. The Grizzlies trail by 11. Morant passes to Tillman. Smart again, Irving. Smart kicks to Morant. Passes it to Bain. Good and a nice assist from Morant. Bain's got 32 points. You love how each side has risen to the challenge throughout this one. Hey, defense is taking a back burner. Secondary on the marquee, but who doesn't love a game like this? Let's go. I like offense. They get it again. Smart. Goes up again. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. Really strong rebounding on the interior. And he gets the, at the easy line for put the Grizzlies, Marcus Smart at the line for one. That one falls for Smart. 
now Doncic. He kicks it to Irving. And the pass to Pop. Doncic outside. Takes the three. Hits the three-point pop. Doncic has got nine points in the quarter. One of the things I love most about Luka Doncic is court recognition and awareness. This guy is so sharp and alert. Understands how to play. Bain passes to Tillman. Well-timed pass, and it goes straight to the bucket for the layup. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the balance. Back to Doncic. Powell kicks to Irving. Pass to Hardaway. It's over Morant. The shot, no good. And Memphis the other way now. Here's Smart. And oh boy, a lot of contact there. But he gets the call and will shoot two. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. As tough as they get. Smart, a bulldog out there, does a good job of drawing contact, oftentimes by initiating it. And the first one drops. And so, Smart nails both of them. Mavericks Dallas calls ball. timeout. to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Luka Doncic. Yeah, and his performance has been a jaw dropper. It must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. Well, I was able to listen in on what Jason Kidd went over with his team. His concern was both their inconsistency and their amount of three-point shots. He said, let's move the ball for good shots. If you have an open three, take it. Otherwise, let's attack the rim and put some pressure on these guys. Kevin, please. Thank you, David. And the foul called on Xavier Tillman. That's his first foul. Side Hardaway. Pass to Jones. Shot clock at five. Dallas needs to get off a shot. And here's Doncic from the arc. And the rebound by Jaron Jackson. Jackson's got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three point play. Irving. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he wants it for the rest of this game. Mavericks making a switch here. Curry's checked in. And he's got such a smooth stroke, and it never changes, even in this kind of a high-pressure situation. against Smart. Two minutes remaining to the game. This is a to And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. If you want a guy who makes plays when it matters most, the guy you want is Luka controlling the offense here. Luka. At the line for two.
And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to fall. And you'd rather not foul Doncic here because he loves getting to the line and delivering. Second of two is good. That will put them up by two. And at this point in the game, there can be a massive difference between a two and a three-point advantage. Now a timeout called by Memphis. They're down by two. 153 left in the fourth quarter. On the way against Morant. to tie it up. Outside, Smart. Moran finds Smart. That ties it up. Moran. Moran's got 15 points here in the second half. No stranger to big moments. Moran wants to be the man to take and make the big shot. Anjic passes to Bob. Doncic against Spain. Now the pass to Hardaway. From outside, off the mark. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for Memphis. Memphis moving that ball around. Morant outside to take the lead. Good D by Hardaway. Dallas has gone into a funk from downtown in the fourth. Only one of their five three-pointers has found the bottom of the bucket. against Spain. Now, here's Doncic. Defense right on him. Bucket is good. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. Well, that was one, two. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. Morant passes to Tillman. It's tipped. Mike seeing Powell flex his muscle on the defensive end. Really good at timing his jump to block the shot. Leases one from three. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent passing. Timeout call. The Grizzlies. They're trailing by five. We've got 28 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Here's Morant. It's rebounded by Dallas. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. And so they choose to intentionally foul. 15 pounds. At the line for Dallas. Luka Doncic. Taking two shots. He drops the first one and that increases their lead to six. He's off on the free throw, unable to get that second one to drop in. Can't waste any time here. No, you need a quick bucket and then a quick foul. And it's Morant missing. And now they decide Jackson to foul intentionally. Jared Jackson Jr. Fourth personal foul. Team is in the At the line for Dallas. Luca got Two shots. free throw is good and that makes it a seven point lead second one is 
is good. We both at the line. It's an eight-point game. Outside, Bain. Nails the trade. Desmond Bain. Seven seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. So they foul intentionally. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Seth Curry at the line for two. Gets the first, and that increases their lead to six. And you know, for Curry, getting into the league has been a battle for Seth. I mean, he's more established and playing with more confidence now. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a seven-point game. And it's the Grizzlies with the ball. Morant passes to Tillman. Misses. So we see the Mavericks get the win here. They didn't make it easy on themselves or their fans, but in the end, everyone satisfied. Well, I mean, there were some times that, that momentum shifted, and, and, and especially early on, but let's give this group a lot of credit for that stick to it to this.